George Wilborn, Bays in After Dark, Man on the Street. What's your name? Sissy. Sissy. After the affair, that's the topic. How do you move past an affair? How do you go beyond? Either you're going to forgive them and stay with them, or don't go back with them at all. You move on. You meet somebody else. What do you mean? How do you move on? You funny. How do you move beyond an affair? You find another woman? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just get, some, get somebody yeah, else. Yeah, it, it, you know, it takes time. I mean, it, it, really, it really depends on how long you've been with that person. Mm -hmm. And if it was just a fly by night, six months or so, not even a year, then it's easier. But if it's been years, then you really want to destroy some property and then you want to move on. Oh, you was the other woman. <laughs> so you've never, you've never been in a situation where you? Yes, I have. Let me oh, stop lying. Yes, yeah, please stop lying. Yes. How do you move beyond and get past an affair? Murder? Survival. And you know what? Sometimes people think the grass is green on the other side. Hmm. You better ask my ex. Welcome back to Bays and at the Dogs. Make some noise! It's a party up in here. Tonight's mad issue is after the affair. Do you forgive and forget? You see my first guest on the Today Show, Oprah. You go, girl. And a relationship expert. She is a relationship expert and life coach, Dr. Michelle Callahan. <laughs> Jafat, mm, 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 back to you. <laughs> my next guest is best known for his role in The Cosby Show. He's also appeared on General Hospital and one of my favorite movies, Strictly Business. That was the bomb. That's a classic. <laughs> Please show some love, political commentator and author. He's in the house, Joseph C. Phillips. Good job. And please, my next guest, yeah. the future Mrs. Basin. <laughs> You've seen on New Jack City and, of course, Showtime series Soul Food. Please show some love for my girl Vanessa Williams is in the house. <laughs> and the man that has promised not to kiss up to these fine women, George Wilborn, is in the house. Yes. I won't do it. Don't do it. Now, now, when we started, George, I'm going to have you set this thing off. Mm -hmm. I said men seem to have a more difficult time forgiving than women do. And, George, you said why. I don't, were you joking when you said what you said or not? No, I wasn't, I wasn't joking. I'm, I'm serious about that. And I cleaned it up a little bit. But, <laughs> you know, men, when, when it happens to us, the things that we, we think of that we just can't get out of our heads, and whether it's a part of our what, What's our in makeup, our heads? Let's, let's be specific The fact about. that someone's been with what, what we feel belongs to us. And they've been inside the of rub. what belongs to us. That's exactly the rub. You're, you're co-signing yeah. well, well, I'm saying that's the rub. It's like not just the minimal, but it's, it's that whole belonging to it. It's that whole like possessiveness right. of right. it. And the thing is, we don't belong to each other. We're choosing every time to be with each other. That's so no, true. I mean, affair is not the right thing to do. It's not the right way to deal. But it's just like this big signpost that says there's something amiss in the relationship that needs to be addressed. And that's like a poor way to deal with it, but it is a, t a coping way. 